Hi and welcome to Kaylin Dash Tech Lesson 25. Here we're going to uh, go a little bit further in protecting our G003 BGP interface uh, to our upstream ISP. We're going to protect port 179, TCP port 179, which is the BGP communication port, um, from access to anything other than our specified peers that we want. Uh, to be able to access that port and uh, create a peering relationship with us. Um, what will happen is if you utilize Nmap or something like that, instead of seeing it open, you'll see it as filtered, which is it, um, uh, only what Nmap will show. Um, it won't show anything else, okay? Uh, which is normally okay for an open-ended um, upstream ISP connectivity where we have to do everything we can do possibly to protect our G003 interface, given that this is a high-speed connection and obviously we're not going to have any firewalls in between okay so let's go ahead and configure up a firewall filter which is all it is and we're going to apply it to our g003 interface so first of all let's just confirm our interface configurations okay so if we go to our internet cloud and we do a run show configuration interfaces GE0 oh it's the only one that's configured Z GE003 okay so we know it's 30 okay at that end which means it'll be a, um, a 29 from this end or should be uh, run show configuration interfaces GE003 Okay, let's have a look. Yeah, 29. Okay, so we've got no filters on there. So let's have a look at our filter lists, if we have any, which I do not think we do. So uh, let's do a run show configuration. Uh, let's do firewall. Um, we'll do a display set. And no, there's nothing there. Okay, so... Um, Let's go ahead and configure this up then. So we're going to do an edit this time um, so that I can edit from a particular point within the configuration, a particular stanza. Okay. Um, so we're going to edit the firewall family. Uh, INET filter. And we'll call it BGP filter dash 179. Okay, so as you can see in here, this is where we're editing, editing it from, okay, this point here. So we no longer have to type in set firewall family inet filter BGP. We just simply do a set and any of the commands that would normally come in here after that, okay. So we can do a set term one from source address. Okay, and do you remember our source address was 246? And we can confirm that because we did it via the loopback. So if we go on to here and we have a look at the configuration of LO0, and there it is, 246. Okay, there's the address there. Okay, that's our source address that we want to allow this from. Okay, we want to deny everything else, but we want to allow it from there. So 192.168.1.246. Okay. Our address this end is 252. We know that. Okay, so we can do a set term 1 from destination address is 192.168.1.252. So if you remember our filter rulings, at the moment what we're doing is if we were stating that this was an access list, which it kind of is, we're saying... If you're coming from here, going to here, okay? So coming from this source address, going to this destination address. So our next line, we need to tell it what exactly. So we're going to say the protocol that we want it from. Well, we know it's TCP port 179, so we'll say from protocol, okay? TCP is the protocol. Now, from 
what's the destination port? Okay, so the destination port is, as I've just mentioned, 179. Okay, um, then we want to accept that. So we're basically saying now, if it's from this source address to this destination, utilizing TCP port 179, then we want to accept it. Okay, so we're going to do a then accept. Okay, so that's our term one. Now we're going to go to term two, because this is where we want to deny everything. Now, because the packets are going to go through this, everything that we want to accept is going to be accepted in here. So anything else we want to deny, that's why we need to use a new term. So we're going to do now from source, and the source address this time is going to be everything else. So we can do a, to cover everything, we can do this. We can do a default for everything. Okay. The destination address, again, is our address, our peering address, okay? And ours is 192.168.1.252, and that's fine. Again, the TCP port, so the protocol, so from protocol is TCP, and the destination port is 179 okay now again we want to do this silently so we're going to do a if you remember silent is a discard no information sent back okay we're going to discard but at the same time we also want to log any of these attempts all right we don't want them not to be logged we want them to be logged so that we'll do a then log okay and then we need to accept everything else Remember our, remember how we do the filters. So as long as there's no other filters, and there will be later, but there isn't at the moment, then we can do a then accept, all right? And if we leave the then accept on here, then this filter has to be last in the um, order of filters on uh, the particular interface. Okay, sorry, um, term three. So we have to do it in that particular order, okay? And to come out of this, we can simply do top. That takes us back to the top of the menu, and we'll do a commit. Now we have to apply that to our interface. So we do a set. Interfaces, GE. We know it's GE003. Unit 0. Family. INET. Filter input it's our BGP filter 179 and we'll commit that and that will only allow us now um, let's 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 just look at it again a minute at the filter sorry again one-handed typing a um, bit difficult to get a new um, a new mic standing um, with the current state of play in the country um, so we do a run show configuration firewall and we'll do a display set okay so there we go so what we're saying is when a packet comes in are you from 192 168 1.246 yes i am are you destined for 252 yes i am are you destined for TCP? Yep. Port 179, yes. Okay, we're going to accept you then. Okay. Are you from 246? No. Okay, well, all of this is null and void. It will then jump to here. Are you from anywhere else? Well, yes, you are, obviously. Is your destination to here? Yes. Are you on TCP port 179? Yes. Well, we're going to log your attempt, and then we're going to discard it. Are you from here? No. Ignore this. Are you from anywhere else? Yes. Are you destined for here? No. Ignore this. Jump to here. Accept. Okay. But as we've said, there'll be plenty more filters put on this interface um, to protect our internal network. Okay.
So that's a quick, easy lesson on um, how to protect your BGP peerings, okay? Um, or your BGP interface, if you like. Um, just ensure that any source addresses that you do want to allow, you add to this. So you can add another line in from another source address or another or another. Or if they're on the same network, just, just include the network address range. Okay, thank you very much for listening. Look forward to the next lesson.